<laughs> Last week on Del Marble Life, we talked about this mild mannered army veteran. This is Wayne Reese, who has a couple of moves. <laughs> moves that got him seen on the national stage and live with Kelly and Ryan, where he won the trivia dancer contest. Wow. wow. Thank, and, you. Thank you. And in addition to that, you have TikTok followers. <laughs> Yes. A lot of them, right? <laughs> uh, I estimate right now uh, about 283,000. <gasps> Goodness gracious! Well, welcome to Del Marva Life! Thank you, thank yeah. you for being here with us. Yeah, Goodness. yeah, and you got your, uh, now tell us about your, uh, yeah, is this a, uh, your <clears throat> uncle, grandpa, what is this? So when the annual King of Baltimore competition began, I entered and I had this entity that I created where I embody the idea that dancing is timeless. You can't put an age on it or anything like that. So I wanted to prove all my peers, my competitors, or whatever, that not only do I still got it, but it's possible for anybody to be able to do what they want to do if God gives them the ability to. And you got the drive for it. So not only did I get the top two spots in the, uh, preliminary competition, but it shocked the entire competition. So <laughs> I had made my mark that, that <laughs> night. Now, after that, I kind of put Uncle Grandpa on the shelf for a while, and I was just kind of getting my feet wet with the whole TikTok and right. things of that nature. I decided, I said, you know what? I think I'm gonna introduce the world to Uncle Grandpa. And when I did that, I got this idea that, you know what? I'm gonna think outside the box. Not only am I gonna make videos with Uncle Grandpa, I'm gonna go everywhere that I can and just randomly pop out dancing, make sure that it's being recorded and just get blind reactions from everybody. Oh my and goodness. that takes me to uh, my very first and biggest uh, TikTok video, which was uh, Uncle Grandpa invades Denver International Airport. I sat up my phone, had a little small portable speaker that was just loud enough had it set there, and I sat down, and all these people were looking at me like, what in the, what's, what's he about to do? And then the music started with a nice little intro to have everybody kind of build up the suspense. And as soon as I kicked my cane, that's it. That's like my, my that's ignition. That's your kickoff, okay. Yes. So I kicked the cane, and I start going, they're like, oh! People start pulling out their phones. <laughs> and one guy, I remember him, red sweat hoodie, he got up with his camera and started pumping his fist and everything. <laughs> and it was just poetry in motion because these weren't reactions that I asked of anybody. They right. were just normal and authentic. And before I knew it, the video hit 4.1 million views. So what was it like to hear from uh, Kelly and Ryan? Wow. I'm still taking that in because how that came about was a good friend and a co-classmate that I'm, that I'm currently working with. Shout out to Amy Horn, uh, CASA executive director. And she hit me up and said, Ty, you really have to uh, submit one of your Uncle Grandpa videos to the Live with Kelly and Ryan show. I said, what for? They're doing the uh, best trivia dancer thing. I said, well, okay, it won't hurt. So I looked it up, followed the rules. I said, okay, I can do this, no problem. I wasn't expecting anything big from it but it was just the opportunity to get my face seen and more exposure. So I was like, all right, cool, no problem. And months later, they, uh, one of the producers contacted me and said, uh, I don't know if you're aware, but you're one of the finalists on our, our Viewer's Choice Awards for Live with Kelly and Ross. I said, say what? <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, I thought I lost already. No, nope, no, you didn't. You didn't. You just, that was just for the, the weekly. They choose a winner every week, but your video was still voted by America uh, to be one of our finals, one of our six finals. So they set up a, a Zoom meeting with me. When I get on the live, uh, the, the, the recording and everything, and then before I knew it, it was like, yes, our winner is Wayne Reese from Easton Mary. I was like, <laughs> how about that? What? <laughs> I still laugh to myself about it because it's like, okay, if I get in, that's great. If I don't, meh, at least I tried. And I've had numerous occasions where I've done that and the, the end result was totally different. I've auditioned for America's Got Talent twice. Uh, I've I tried to audition for So You Think You Could Dance, but believe it or not, 
I got disqualified because of my age. Oh no. Okay. It wasn't because of my, my, my skill or my talent. They was like, yeah, you're too old. I was like, <laughs> what? Well, too old. here you are on Del Marva Life. Yes, so. yes. Huge blessing. Yes. Well, thank you so much for being here, Wayne. Thank you for having and me. And congratulations thank on you. everything. But we got to ask you one more question. Sure. Do you think he will? Do you think he'd do that? Will you dance us out to the break? Why not? <laughs> All right, let's go. The floor is yours, brother.